Not even two weeks ago, the Queen passed away, leaving us all very sad. She was a remarkable woman and will be so missed. In today's episode, we will do some vintage shopping near Manchester to look for Queen Elizabeth II special pieces. Good morning. Good morning. I really hope we can find something here because yeah, do you remember we bought this gorgeous tea caddy? Yeah, the one we've got in our kitchen. Yes, it must be from the 40s. Yeah, because it shows Princess, Princess Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Yes, Princess Elizabeth, her father, her mom, and Margaret. Princess Margaret. And yeah, we will be browsing as well, just in general, general because we usually find something. Yeah? Sure. Let's start. Let's go inside. We haven't been to this place for quite a while and to be honest with you, it's actually our favourite spot for vintage shopping. We can really recommend it. They do have a lot of stamps and things, but we're looking for plates or something. Okay, this is a sport terrain and it's 30 pounds. I think we might need to get this. We found another tea caddy. And this is from the Silver Jubilee. We're going to get this one. Look at this! <laughs> Let me have a look! <laughs> I love the two chairs. Not oh. that we need them, no. but... Well, someone left the Costa... Costa mug. How much are they? Each 145. Well, the upholstery is not too bad. It's great. I love the paintings. Look at this one. That's wonderful. Jörg, can you check for me how much that is? This one? How much is it? <laughs> you can't see it, but... 300 pounds, but for the size, it's not too bad. Beautiful. Imagine having this in a library. And also, I do love this one as well. Yeah. I like it. Let me see how much it is. Okay. Um, this is uh, 125. I love a hat box like this. I just can't get in there. <laughs> Um, Christie's, what does it say? Christie's London. Yeah. Let me see. <laughs> so this is uh, 35 quid. Not too bad. 
Not that I like the fabric itself, but uh, I just had a look. This is just £65, which is great, isn't it? I mean, it's in a good condition. It's great. Love this raffia chair as well. And this is £32. Look, I just found this book with a lot of pictures. The Queen Mother, and I think it has wonderful pictures. Five pounds, and um, I just saw Look. there was a picture showing Princess Elizabeth. Wow. There she is, H10. Yeah. And I think this is actually a wonderful book, isn't it? Yeah. I love this one as well. I think it shows pictures that you're not really familiar with. No. Yeah, I love 90, it. 1946. Yes. And that was when she, the Queen was 20. Mm -hmm. So we always get so many questions about uh, Mason Cash balls and I think that should be one. No. Yeah, can you read it? I can't read it. Um, it's not Mason Cash. Uh, the, the grip stand. But it's basically, well, it's the same style. And this is £12. So I is, think it's okay. It's, yeah. That's really good. This is where we're going to have tea in a second because they always have such a great selection of cakes and wonderful tea. Now look at our teapots. This is very special. Yes. <laughs> I love it. So you have, this is lemon drizzle, right? Lemon drizzle. Yeah. And uh, this is gluten-free carrot cake.
we found some wonderful things at the Vintage Emporium, which we will show you at home. And we're now at a place called Old Mill and Teas, which is amazing. They have great Chesterfield sofas. They even have cars. Although, I, I have to say, I always find it very strange to buy things from here or to get them out yeah. without destroying them. Well, we do know that the BBC actually buys furniture here or hires them and we can see why because they have so much. Okay, we just came home and thought we need to share what we actually bought. We didn't buy too much. We always, we, we, I don't know, this is our approach. We only buy what we absolutely love. And we think we found some wonderful items to remember the beloved queen. I think prices right now are going up. So you probably need to be a bit more careful. This is what we bought. We fell in love with this, well, another tea caddy. And this is from the, from the Queen's Silver Jubilee. And maybe we keep it here. We don't know yet. Maybe I will take it to the office. Then we found this gorgeous coronation mug showing Queen Elizabeth's father, George VI. And we think... This is a little bit smaller, so it would be wonderful for milk or small flowers. And we bought this gorgeous coronation mug. This is actually George the Sixth father, what? correct? Yes, this is George the Fifth. <laughs> yes. And so that's Queen Elizabeth's grandfather. Yes. And what we need to find now, we need to find a coronation mug showing Queen Elizabeth. But, um, well, they didn't have any. Then we found this beautiful Queen Mother book and in fact it was a little bit hidden away and I think we were so lucky to actually spot it and it has such beautiful pictures in it. Pictures I haven't seen before, I must admit. And well, also a lot of pictures showing Queen Elizabeth. So I need to show you. This is the Queen Mother and this is Queen Elizabeth when she was born. Yeah. And the royal family, Queen Elizabeth. So many beautiful pictures. This is wonderful as well. I must say this is one of my favourites. And yeah, he as well. Or this picture here showing the Queen and baby Prince Edward and we think this is such an adorable book and um, yeah we're so lucky that we found it wonderful and something else which was such a coincidence because we were about to leave the shop and then I spotted this book which is about Colfax and Fowler the best in English interior decoration. And I've been a Colfax and Fowler fan for decades now. I just love their style. And we actually have a lot of Colfax and Fowler here at home. And the book is actually from 
I think 1989 and browsing the book I can see that I absolutely adore the style and it's still beautiful to this day which goes to show this is I think how it should be and we didn't get this bow terrain by the way I, I fell in love with it the moment I saw it but then on closer inspection we saw that it had a lot of cracks so we thought no we give that a pass and just keep on looking now as you can see we found some things to remember the queen yes, yes. Um, i think what we need to get now is a coronation mug definitely a coronation mug or maybe a wonderful plate but i'm sure we will find something but i just said yeah that prices go up so we need to be careful probably yeah because some dealers I think just overpriced yeah, things. No. We always, I think, the Vintage Emporium, I think it was our fourth time there. Yeah, but we always, it's always nice there. It's so, so nice. It's our favourite place for vintage shopping and the tea room is wonderful as well, so we can highly recommend. We hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and as always, we'll see you again very soon. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Bye.